Hi, this is Travis from Tenno Farms, and I wanted to show you the inside of the water softener today. We have a well water and have a lot of iron in our water, so I just wanted to show you cleaning out the orifice valve. This is something you have to do every once in a while because the iron will get in there and kind of build up, plug things up, and then you'll start turning everything orange in your house. So this is what the orifice looks like when it's all opened up here. And these are the guts of it here. So there's the main filter with the O-ring. Then this kind of plate here with another little valve on it. A rubber gasket. Another little kind of mesh screen. And another uh, rubber valve there. So what you want to do when you get this all opened up like I've got it, you just kind of want to clean the rust and gunk out of these things. So get them as clean as you can. I've already got them clean. Then when you start putting it back together, you'll notice on these, one side is flat and one side is concave. You want to put the concave side down. So I'm going to kind of just put this back together so you can see. So this goes down in this little hole here. Let's see if I can get it in there. There we go. So I put that down in there. Then the screen goes down in there, tiny little thing here. So you can kind of see how that lays in there. So the screen is facing down. Then next you're gonna put this gasket in, goes on top of those. You line it up with the opening right here. Kind of push that down on top so nothing can move around in there. Get it nice and flat. Everything's lined up. And then over here, this kind of plastic piece here, you want to do the same thing with this rubber gasket. You want to put the concave side down. Just press it in there. And then put it right down on top of this, line it up with the kind of peg there, slide that down. There we go. And then last, you're going to take your main screen and gasket, and you're going to line everything up with that too here. You're going to put it down in the hole. Trying to keep everything straight here while I'm doing this. It's hard to do one-handed. I think I got it lined up there. Yep, it's not moving. So we've got our O-ring on top with the screen. Everything's lined up there with that opening. Got to kind of push it down in there and make sure it's flat. And just take the lid right here and tighten that back down on top of it. Tighten that down, and there you go. So we've now replaced the cap, and the orifice valve is all clean. So we'll turn the water softener back on here, and hopefully we will not have orange water or orange stains anymore now, now that that's cleaned out. Thanks for watching.